Welcome back. So I need to refresh my hair. I want to do like a wet wavy style. So it's gonna look like it's wet, but it's not. That fresh out of the shower look. So I have this Miss Jessie Coily Custard. I know this for sure makes my hair look shiny and wet when it's not. But my friend gave me this and I'm gonna see if this can do the same thing. Other things that I'm gonna have is a spray water bottle and one bristle brush, one wide tooth comb. So I'm gonna part my hair at the ear and I'm gonna do a total of four braids because I don't want my waves to be too small. The smaller the braid, the smaller the waves. The bigger the braid, the bigger the waves. The wetting of your hair is what makes it moldable. It's kind of like putting water on dried up clay, then it becomes formable again to whatever you want. That's what water does on hair. And what you do with the hair, whether you put it in some sort of braid twist or in some sort of curler waveformer what that does is just shape it into what you want it to be when you take it out so we want it to be shaped wavy so we're gonna twist it i mean we're gonna braid it The wetter your hair is, the more the product also easily distributes throughout your hair. And if you have, well actually, whether you have straight hair or naturally curly hair, the wetter your hair is, the more flat it becomes. Less frizzy. Less frizz means less volume. So you manipulate how much water you want in your hair based on how much volume you want in your hair. How Smooth or straight, you want your hair. A bristle brush also helps evenly distribute product throughout your hair and water. Make sure you touch up the roots of your hair, especially in front of your face. Make sure you do it tight. The thicker your strands are that you grab, the sections you grab, the thicker this is, the longer it's going to take to dry. So keep that in mind if you are doing this in the evening like me and you're going to be going somewhere in the morning. Me, I'm not going anywhere until the afternoon.
Okay. So I'm gonna do all this side, Miss Jessie. And the other side, I'm gonna do the Shea Moisture one. And I am hoping that the Shea Moisture can compete because if it can't, I'm gonna be looking crazy with one side looking all shiny and luscious from Miss Jessie and the other side looking dry. Cause I have no doubt that it's gonna freeze my hair and whatnot, but the Miss Jessie really gives your hair a shine and makes, and makes it look like it's still wet. Parting at the ear. If you want more volume in your hair when you take it out, don't put a lot of water at the roots. I have plenty of volume. I don't need more volume. Shea Moisture Daily Hydrating Styling Gel. My friend bought two of these. I guess they were on sale or something. She bought two of them or three of them. A stock. And she ended up not liking it. She said that it was drying. She felt like it was drying. So, we'll see. Literally says hydrating on the thing. So they shouldn't be lying like that. But you know that's what they do. This definitely has way more slippage. It, it distributes to the hair better. And it's hard to keep in your hands. Some just fell off onto the ground. Let me make sure I get the front of my hair. One last section. to go on a hair growth journey and not put heat in my hair for two years. I decided to do it for one year, but after I got to the one year, it just somehow turned into two years. So I haven't put heat in my hair for two years in order to just grow it out. And I'm gonna put that video up soon. So if you want to do that, see that, subscribe so you'll be notified <sighs> when I was doing my hair growth journey for two years I didn't do much to my hair I didn't manipulate it much at all and I put natural products in it I didn't wash my hair often with shampoo 
Um, and anytime I did wash my hair with shampoo, I only washed the roots of it. If I wanted to kind of detox my whole head and my hair, I would just do lemon juice, fresh lemon juice from a tree. Or I would do apple cider vinegar watered down. If you don't know that the, if you don't know the scalp is acidic. So, all done. And I'll see you guys tomorrow when I take it out. It is the next evening, about to go to my friend's house. This is how I'm looking. Okay, so comparison with Miss Jessie on this side, and then we have Shane Moisture on this side. I would say they look equally as shiny. They look good. This side might even look better, but it's still wet, so that might be why it looks better. So this is what you do. You have part, you move some of your hair on this side, this way. And then you move the hair on this side, that way. Grab this side. Then flip your hair. This is the the roots. Just move the roots around. Just massage it. You can even do the whole thing if you want. It adds volume. Oof. I'm just gonna put some of this on my hair. See how the back looks now? Let me make sure that. Take the back of your crown right here and you make sure there's no part. What you can do is pull it up and put it back down. Move it to where this part of your hair doesn't go to the side but lays back here. Okay. This is how it looks in the back. I'll put all my hair in socks. And if you don't want a middle part, which some days I don't, most days I don't, if I'm honest, this is what I do. I just take it to the side that I want it to go. Just right there. <laughs> just like that. Or. Because I'm Hawaiian, I like to wear a flower in my ear. And because I'm married, I wear my flower on this side. You wear it on the same side as your ring finger. It means you're married. The other side means you're single. So, I'm just move it to that side. And that's it. Sometimes I like to perfect the look by bringing my baby hair forward so they're not sticking up and sometimes I'll get a little hair by my ear and then let it curl
really important is that the very roots in the front is looking under control and moisturized. That's what everything is will be that you can't get away with. Hope you enjoyed this. Subscribe for more. Just got back from my friends, and this is how my hair is looking. Not fuller. <laughs>